let's look at preventive and detective controls and we are still continuing with topic for auditing which is internal controls so let's look at the preventive and then detective controls so we shall start with the preventive controls so preventive controls as you hear it like it's preventing something yeah preventive controls attempt to deter or prevent undesirable events from occurring they prevent undesirable events from occurring and they are proactive controls that help to prevent a loss yeah they are put in place to prevent a loss or to stop something from occurring something bad from occurring because you, you you cannot prevent something good from occurring yeah. so those are the preventive controls they prevent undesirable events from occurring and examples of preventive controls can be like segregation of duties to prevent fraud proper authorization adequate documentation physical control over assets to prevent theft and loss yeah things like that then let's look at the detective controls so the detective like detecting it's like finding out yeah so this attempt to identify or de detect undesirable acts like identify something that is not needed so they provide evidence that a loss has occurred but they do not prevent a loss so these ones just provide evidence of something then the preventive they prevent something from occurring so an example of detective controls can be reviews like you review something so that you can be able to identify something to identify what you are looking for then analyze variance analysis like to see whether there is a difference reconciliations physical inventories and audit those are some of the examples of detective controls that will help you to identify whether a loss has occurred or not. So preventive and detective controls are both essential to an effective internal control system because the detective will help you to identify, then the preventive will help you to prevent something from occurring. So they are both essential to an effective internal control system. And from a quality point of view, Preventive controls are essential because they are proactive and they emphasize quality since they prevent something from occurring. However, detective controls play a critical role in providing evidence that the preventive controls are functioning and preventing losses because if the detective controls can be able to identify losses, it means that the preventive controls are not working like the way they are supposed to work. So for the detective controls, they provide evidence that the preventive controls are either working or not.